However, okay, so let me, uh, okay, where did it go? Uh, they're granted a certain amount of XP, which will be applied on, on, on all unlock skills. Easy example is say you have five skills and get 10 XP. Now every skill will receive two XP. Yeah, the XP that they get will be split along currently unlocked skills. Okay. So that's actually good to know. Um, I suppose. Yeah, uh, no, we'll just lock that. And with you. I'll keep this open because you have a special skill for that. But I think... Actually, I'll keep, hold I'll keep lower open. That way you can start... Casting more spells. Oh, I do want to take a look at... Hold on. Titan's Touch. I do want to actually get him up to 50... makes somewhat sense most because he's just gonna do simple uh the sim like simple uh, essentially simple buff That way they all have some uh, heals, I guess. Go back to this though. That's screwed. Lock it. I guess they can continue to to control bigger. Alright, alright, alright. Stand together, stand tall. I don't know what I have. have any of those. I forgot I have this stuff. I completely forgot I had this stuff. Well, anyways.
Okay. But by locking skills, they're not going to get any, get those anymore. Um... Oh, is that items I'm wearing? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. That's what it is. Oh, is that, I thought that's what it was. The hell's the stand together? I'm slightly confused by where that stuff is. But I'm, I'm gonna guess that's like the buff stuff. So I'm actually gonna you off. Hold on. Am I gonna need this? Oh, no. No, I'm not gonna need that at all. Oh, hey, athletics, 69. Nice. Um, actually, I'll leave that. Actually, I'll leave that on because I think I'm just going to, I think I'm going to go ahead and give him a heal too, just to heal himself. I need to get her lore up, like, stat. Her lore really needs to get up. That way I can actually start working on other abilities for her. I need to find a lore, uh, lore specialist. Anyways. Um, oh yeah, I need to, I need to level. Need to level her. Okay, even locked it a little goes uh, up that, so. Um, what are you? Teb's presence frightens nearby Bane. We are starting to fight, uh, fight a lot of Bane, so. Um, so we need two more skills into here. One grants a bonus, uh, bonus to magic defense. Grants armor, or bonus armor while Eb is wearing light. What are you? Grants a bonus to control grave light skill and grave light magic at night. I mean, not bad.
Not gonna lie though. <clears throat> With how things are going, I may just go and get the other, the old guy back. Because he had a lot of lore. I think he was at 80 or 90. But I love Eb's uh, Mother's Embrace skill. What's this cone? Only five meters though? Ew. Uh, sure. We'll grab this and the next level we'll grab this so we can grab this. We'll, we'll, we'll go with this. By your command. Ooh, something's down here. Still some loot up here. Yeah, we we cannot leave loot behind, Chad. No loot left behind. <clears throat> what the hell are you? Oh, interesting. Well, none of us are a two-handed bow, so Ooh, what is in this? Quick save before we screw something up. Thank you very much. Oh, how handy of them. Oh, how handy. More on their way. I'm not afraid. Are you? <laughs> well, somebody sounds afraid to me. Anyways. No reason to tear it. It's a battle! Get them? I did. Okay, good. Um, I want you to go ahead and blur. Bear, got it. You go ahead and might yourself. Barrick, go ahead and might yourself. You come forward a little bit. Care of it. Oh, no. <laughs> Surge is drawn to the outside air. Corpses? Or those stone ornaments? All three? Hmm. It's a battle! Ah! Run, Ev! Run! Come 
Yeah, I think I'll uh, I think I'll keep them with control, life control, vigor. Or actually, no. Lock both of those. Same with you. Does this just uh, increase the chance of critical hits, which increases the amount of health restored with a single spell? I don't think I. Think I. Maybe I do actually. The control vigor part. Yeah, the control vigor part, I don't think I necessarily care about. Uh... Oh, nice. Thank you. Uh, it's duration. The crystal in the beacon shimmers softly. See that on the wall? That glowing symbol must have some use. Oh, what are you? Uh, plus one deflection, plus one precision. Is that good on you? Oh, that is so good on you. this at all i i don't think i really care about the extra dps on her i'm more interested in the uh sigil regeneration or the you know sigil uh, sigil of life skill on this As long as they target the right person. Are you afraid of death? <laughs> Just point me in the right direction. This is going well. Take that. Right. Uh. 
I will aid you. Okay, any more of them? No? Okay. Ooh. When pressing charcoal to the parapets, you capture a blurry but proportionate image of the ancient relief. Uh, with enough collected imprints, it may be possible to reconstruct the original ship in ruin. While exploring, you acquired a charcoal rubbing. Perhaps examining the rubbing further might help you determine, and determine its importance. I don't think this is gonna get uh become bad in a while. I'm bad for a while. See what I see. Whoa! Oh, this 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 looks fantastic. See subtle movement beneath the faintly glowing surface. That old wall's beast appeared trapped. For the moment, at least. Good thing I quick saved. Anyways, <clears throat> judging by the armor, the corpse appears to be one of the fallen regions of Stalwart. His unconventional final resting place is a platform surrounded, uh, surrounded by an arcane barrier. It's unclear whether or not the arrangement was intentional. Crystal of the beacon is not responding to Torsky. <coughs> okay, I can't get up there. Was the one I just attained this one? Don't have that one. Okay, I don't have enough of these. I 
is that? Grab, go grab. Thank you. Just for the record, I could make that jump, but I'm not going alone. Trouble is. Of course, we get into the completely wrong position. Actually, no, uh, Z's working on that, so we'll go ahead and pop that off. Fall before me! Come back here and die! Oh my god! Go and run! We have now once per combo when Barrick's health reaches a critical level, he will be healed instantly. Uh, bond with an ally, sharing the damage. Uh, leap to the aid. Okay, what is on here? Once per combo when Barrick's health is critical, he will gain a significant armor bonus for a short time. Uh, bond of honor. Okay. Maintain a stance that is equal parts offensive and defensive, gaining an armor bonus and dealing uh, piercing damage to enemy melee. Okay. Ooh, that seems nice. I need 12 total points. Yeah, I have rarely, I, I haven't really even touched this area. Yeah, I haven't even really touched that area. <laughs> 